Memorial Day is a day of remembrance, a day to honor those who paid the ultimate price for our freedom. From wreath laying ceremonies to taps tributes, there were events held all across our area today. KPRC 2's Taisha Walker live tonight with a look at some of those moving Memorial Day moments. Taisha? Dominique, today was an emotional day for families of those service members who have paid for our freedoms with their lives. And there were a number of tributes to these brave men and women. It's the mournful melody musician Len Valka plays every Memorial Day. I come out here just to give back and, and, and say thank you for the members who have served and given all. And uh, I'm really here for the families who are out here to spend time at, with their loved ones' uh, uh, headstones. For families visiting the Houston National Cemetery, like the Guercas, 24-year-old Joe died in November of 2004 during his second tour in Iraq. One of his homebirds, him and his platoon, uh, there was a uh, to a mission and uh, uh, they hit a, 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 a bomb. Mayor Sylvester Turner also visited the National Cemetery to lay a wreath to honor and remember fallen service members. A 21 gun salute and ceremony at Sugarland Memorial Park. Arthur Samaniego, are you in? This Fort Bend County Wall of the Fallen gets Marine Vietnam War veteran Gregory Rios choked up. Because I know some of these guys. Every time. As veterans, we always talk about it. Our younger generation doesn't show much interest. Rio says today isn't about the sales or barbecue, but the sacrifice. And hopefully everybody is uh, thinking about maybe loved ones or other people that have passed away in you know, all the previous wars. Families have come throughout the day, several strangers who don't have loved ones who have served, but say this was just a small way to say thank you for those that have sacrificed everything. If you would like to come to the ceremony to pay your respects, you can do so until 9 o'clock tonight. Reporting live, Taisha Walker, KPRC 2 News.